Hey too, I'm back this time with the last part of my Bath & Body Works collection update for summer of 2022. This part is my pocket back. So uh, not a whole lot going on, but let's talk about what I've got. So as you can see up here, um, so this top row is pocket backs I have that are not currently being used and the bottom row that I have is pocket backs that are in my current summer use it up challenge. So for the ones I have just kind of waiting in the wings, I have two rose water and ivies, a pineapple prosecco, which is such a gorgeous fragrance. I love it. And two blueberry crumbles down here, um, almost the same. So I have one strawberry pound cake. It's my last one, a pineapple prosecco and a blueberry crumble. So as you can see in my pocket back collection, not a whole lot of variation. So uh, this collection is a little bit interesting because I have not purchased a pocket back in almost a year. So I I typically use one or two a month. I don't go th through them especially quickly. Um, so like pocket backs are fun, but I don't really ever get tempted by them, if that makes sense. So for that reason, I tend to purchase them um, in fragrances that I really love. And then I just kind of like ride that wave for a while and just kind of use them up. So What's gonna happen in my collection is that I'll use up these three, at least hopefully by the end of August, and then I'll probably just pull these five and just utilize them in my fall challenge. I mean, maybe I'll pick up a couple just to get a little bit of variety going on here, but I don't know, we'll see. Um, so like I said, like I love them. I think the pocket bags are fun, but you know, I don't get tempted like I do like with soaps and shower gels and whatever, so. Um, so yeah, that's why you don't see that variation here. And I'm pretty pr uh, proud of my progress here. So when I did this back in January, I had 16 pocket backs and now I'm down to eight total. So I'm pretty happy with that. I do look forward to the day when I can um, buy some more. Like I said, I might pick up like one or two or whatever for the fall. We'll just kind of see how it goes. Um, but I am very proud of my progress. I'm very proud of the fact that it has been almost a year since I've purchased a pocket back. Um, and yeah, so yeah, not a whole lot going on, but I do love these fragrances. Rose Water Ivy especially is fabulous in a pocket back. Blueberry Crumble is just blueberry pie in a pocket back and Pineapple Prosecco is such a yummy fragrance. So, so that is it for my summer collection, at least like all of my Bath & Body Works collection. I hope you all enjoyed watching this series. I'll be back with this series um, again, just like how I typically do every six months. So around the holidays, like December into January, I'll do this series again, and then it'll be fun to see how my collection has changed, especially this one, because in theory, I should have all these gone by the time um, I update you with that collection. So that's always, uh, or that's all. Um, as always, thank you for kind of following me on my journey to use up my Bath & Body Works collection and just my experiences with enjoying Bath & Body Works in general. So with that, please make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Schoolhouse of Iron. I'll put that down below. Uh, this time around, I am going to also show you my candle collection, which will be a good video. So definitely stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Bye.